Now, originally, we had planned to hit the beach, slow cook some pig and bask in the warm return of summer. But this year, summer feels more like January. Cold, unrelenting cool weather that has us in a funk. So it's time for some pork. Yes, that magical animal responsible for all your favorite foods. Bacon, pork chops, Christmas ham, and of course, spam. Today, we call upon that magic animal for some pulled pork lettuce wraps, or die trying. So, today, pulled pork lettuce wraps. What you're gonna need for today's recipe are <clears throat> some noodles, lettuce, uh, green onion, lime, garlic, ginger, some carrots, some peanuts, some sesame oil, and some hoisin sauce. Hoisin sauce, yeah. Uh, and we've got the pig, which we picked up at the butcher. Now you get these guys from a local butcher shop. Pick this up. It was like 12, 15 bucks. You just kind of want to rub it in there, make sure it's getting all the meat. Now the barbecue's nice and hot. You can see the water starting to evaporate. We'll just place them right there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this burner that it's underneath all the way down to low, as well as the one in the middle, all the way down to low. And we'll just have the one on the side cooking, so it's gonna kind of heat. It's gonna come around and kind of bake it, that kind of thing. I'm gonna close that up, wipe my hands, and we'll apply some beer, the goods. Now, Drift Blue is one of my favorite beers, and Farmhand Ale is one of their best. Now, it's gonna go really good with the pork. It's a pretty light beer, delicious, gonna bring out a lot of flavors. And as we baste it, it's going to add a little bit of sweetness and bar. It's just going to add some good flavors to it. So we'll just open this guy up. Now, I'm always a fan of testing the ingredients before you apply them, you know. Just make sure they're good and whatnot. God's nectar right there. Basically what's going to happen is it's going to coat it a bit and then during the cooking, it's going to take about five or six hours, we're going to baste it with this beer as we go. So for our sauce, we're going to start with a three, four cup of hoisin sauce. You know, they're about three, four cup. Mm -mm. Good. And next, rice vinegar. We want uh, one and a half tablespoons of this. So we're going to do three of these. One, two, three, and a little bit more and a tablespoon of liquid honey. That's enough of that. Uh, two tablespoons of water. One tablespoon, two tablespoons. Some fresh lime juice. Two tablespoons of sesame oil. Some garlic. Some grated ginger. About a tablespoon. So let's heat this up here. And get it so it's all combined all together and nice and warm, but not burned. 
you notice how those aren't flip-flops because uh, it's not warm enough for flip-flops yet. It being January and all. It's on cell phone. I think your cell phone is going off. You know, try to be professional. Try to have a cooking show. Get a little fire going like so. Get it going a bit. See, it smokes real good now. Ah, it burns. The eyes, they burn. As you can see. Oh, wait. Uh, anyway. I don't know why I'm on camera. You're supposed to be the host, aren't you? So now we're going to get to work on the uh, wrap portion of our pulled pork while it's cooking. So we've pulled off some lettuce and kept it as intact as possible. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get the, the pork when it's done, put it in the lettuce, add these ingredients, wrap them up, and that's how we're gonna eat them for all you Atkins fans out there. So we're gonna grate up some carrot for our filler here. Okay, and we've got some fresh uh, green onion and we're just going to chop it up. My part's done. When's it gonna be ready? I'm done my part. When, when's your part gonna be done? She's been in there for a while. What, four or five hours maybe? Five hours, yeah, five hours. And uh, there she is. I say she's good and ready. Now, I'm just gonna grab her here. Oh yeah, that's good. Just bring it over here, throw it on this platter. Now, we're gonna take it inside because it's a bit cold out here. It needs to sit for about 15, 20 minutes, kind of cool off and the juices do their thing. And then Jess is gonna uh, rip it apart and try not to screw up my uh, pork. Okay, we're going in. So now we have this massive pile of shredded porky goodness and we're gonna put it into our lettuce wrap. So, a little bit of pork, yes. A lot of pork, let's be serious. And let's, you know, let's get some skinny, fatty pieces on there because they taste good, you know, seriously. Some, now I don't know what these are called, but you know, they're like yellow Asian noodles, firm ones. A few carrot shreds in there, some onion, and the famous sauce. Drizzle that on. Oh, that's good. Cool. And then, you know, it's a lettuce wrap, so you just kind of like do something like that. Hope got the delicious farmhand ale from Driftwood and a freezing cold. January day, hopefully summer sun, uh, shows up for us at some point, you know, because this is ridiculous. Anyways, thanks for watching. Um, check out the website for full recipes and episodes and fun stuff. And cool, thanks for joining us. Be there on time.